sure yet uh, whether we'll be using like some of that for doubles or just dump it all into a larger top eight pot. When so is that? Next Sunday. Okay. Time TV day. Depending on, because we're going to try and advertise in SoCal, see how many people are willing to come down. I'm going to show you the banana forest match connecting. So I see the red Digicom, Mojo the purple. I believe so. I see, uh, you got it right. I red, see yeah, red is nice. Yeah. And so it's been a while since Diddy did as I've been around. Throwback to Apex days when Diddy was still the best character in the game. <laughs> Pre patch. Both are just, I guess, filling each other now out. Lots of, there's going to be a lot of bananas in play. And it's going to come down really to whoever controls more bananas at the time, I guess. Right. And both are going to be looking to poke each other out with aerials, too. I mean, with any ditto, it's more just like a spacing game. Whereas yeah. the more optimal spacing and more... But both will get hoo-hahs, both will get bananas to up smashes. Or uh, also, it's going to come down to if someone's able to edge guard the other. Yep. Which is hard to with Diddy's, but it is doable. And yeah, it's still pretty even right now. I see taking a little bit of a lead. Yeah. Oh, forward <laughs> smash is coming out. Just throwing out forward smashes, but both out of range. And... Nice. Mojo catches the monkey flip. But doesn't get any extra out of it. Now, it's still really close. A smash attack from either would KO. And so... Really? Up smash does not kill. Just yet. Banana, but both actually, both players. I think I should turn to Trump there. Oh, and up smash. But Mojo's up smash will KO. And two bananas coming out. This is like Brawl this Diddy is days. This is Brawl days, yeah. <laughs> Double bananas. On a much buff Diddy. And Icy's just really trying to pull him out with its force smash. Nice shield. Mojo's just playing defensive, that's the style. And it's helping him right now because he can just sit around. It's, the pressure's not on him, it's oh, on Icy. Yeah, nice ledge trap going from Icy. That ledge trap seals the deal. So, once again, pretty even still. Only an 18% deficit. There's down throw into two up airs. Until up air, up throw up air. So I see again taking a bit of a lead, but Mojo's just facing him out, trying to bring him back. Really. Try to he tried to read that roll away, but I see rolls instead in something words. I see really hasn't caught on to Mojo's monkey flip movement though. While Mojo seems to have caught on a bit more to Icy's. Yeah. I agree. Both trading with forward airs. I think at this point they just want to look, look for down tilt to yeah. up smash. Yeah. Look for the down tilt grabs, down tilt up smashes. 10 more percent on either and no KO. Uh, I didn't agree with that recovery, but Mojo not, missed not the punish super hard though. Punish, yeah. I don't think Mojo expected I see the DI backwards that much. And yeah, both of them just throwing out smash attacks. So far, not too effective, but. Smash Attack will KO at this percent, so it's really close between both of them. Yeah. Mm. Banana pressure is just continuing. Ooh. Oh! Banana to force smash will do first. Well, I see, nails it. Yeah, I think I just have to go. That's fine. Pleasure. Pleasure to come today. Yeah, yeah. You too. Yeah. Can you let Brian know? I will. Yeah. So game two, back to Smashville Dittos. Um, it's really going to be about, especially because they're playing the same character, it's going to be about who just reads the movement better. I thought Mojo had a better shot, but I just pulled it through at the end. It was really close though, and we're really just going to see how does Mojo react now. Once again, we're seeing Mojo standard aerial wall. Just really just tossing out short hop pairs, short hop dares. Anything to push him out. Slightly, but Icy's bringing it back now. Down throw, up, up throw, up air, and now a monkey flip. Oh, nice. Get up attack read. 
This is the up air read, but we're setting it. And now, once again, it's really even. As he's just trying to get his banana, get something going, we'll just, just try to space him out. Punish him for throwing out the bananas. And once again, nice monkey flip kill. Or one's a flip read. Mojo. Both trading with the fairs. And once again, trading with the fairs. Yeah. Um, nice banana into forward smash by IC. Holding that one sock lead. And IC has Mojo's banana, so Mojo's unable to bring another banana out. Mojo tried to read them on the clip, but just a tad too slow. Uh, tough. I see just trying to bait Mojo into approaching because Mojo is more defensive naturally. And I see just really punishing him every time because he knows Mojo is going to try and approach. Because the issue's on Mojo to approach now and not that kill. So we see Mojo just reaching for the dash, dash up smashes. Trying to help to get something with a banana up tilt. But I see DI's it. Survives it. Play a nice banana forward smash. Seals the deal. Only 30%. So, Mojo can definitely bring it back. Up throw, up air. Down throw, up air. Down throw, back air. So now, it's still really even. Only 4% difference. I see up throw, up air. Another up air? No. Mojo retaliates. And up throw, up air. Just like the old Smash 4 days when Diddy was the best, but even with Diddy's nerf, he's still really strong. And I see Mojo definitely showed it with their performances this tourney. And they're just really trying to land the banana because you hit them with a the banana, that's your combo. They dodge the banana, then they get two bananas to throw at you. So it's really about just who hits the other with the banana. And that's why they're just trying to call out any shields with the monkey flips. Up throw, up air. Tried to, thought the DI was to the left, but it still got it. Again, up throw, up air. I see he's DIing backwards right now. And, uh oh, forward throw. I see he's gonna try and catch out the recovery. Mojo nicely air dodges and cancels his monkey flip momentum. And both trade bananas, trade forward, uh, trade forward fares. Oh! And Mojo strikes back with an up smash. Once again, these guys are showing that they are really close level to each other. Both playing nearly identical. Thinking of that both players are going to use the exact same options too. Is Icy switching? I think Icy is a bit scared now. Not sure if he wants to stick to the Diddy hub, huh? given how close the last two games were. Or whether he wants to try something different, give him try something else that would give him a different option. It's really hard to say, to say right now. Uh, and Mojo finally enters his name. Ice decides to ride with this trusted and true Diddy Kong. He might take him to Dreamlands. Yeah, definitely looks like a Dreamland game this time. So, once again, both go immediately for the bananas. Bananas are so crucial in Diddy Dittos. As he gets the first grab, tries to go for the up tilt after his up air but misses. Mojo retaliates with his own up throw up air. Yeah, pretty similar. It's pretty standard Diddy Ditto game. Poke. And just really, it's going to be who gets the reads the most, capitalizes the most. So far, I see it's doing an excellent job just walling out Mojo. Just gets about 20-30% off it from the fairs. And Mojo's just getting pushed out now. 
He's trying to approach, but without the banana, you have to go for a pair, and that's kind of that's easy to telegraph and read. Once again, the wall of backers, and Ice is just throwing a banana. If it hits, combo off it. Otherwise, just play patient and let Mojo approach you. Both trade the four airs, and Mojo's now pushing, putting Icy in the corner. Or trading again. Mojo tried to call out Icy's get up from the ledge with a forward smash, but Icy just jumped and air dodges through it. Up throw, up air. Another up air? No. Icy's just playing more cautiously, sitting back, waiting for Mojo's landing option. Both players just so scared right now. There goes the fourth throw, and the banana catches Mojo. As he tried to go for the trump, but Mojo rolls away quickly, gets away from the pressure. And once again, Mojo's in an issue where he's trying to recover while Ice is just trying to read one and catch him off on one of the recovery options. Nice peanut, just catches Mojo out, but unable to convert off it. And Ice is just looking for a banana into smash tag. Go for the safe guaranteed option. And I see he catches him with that up smash. Nice job. And this time the lead's been a lot more than previously. So Motor's gonna need at least 20-30% before he can get a smash attack KO. And and it's pretty funny because the situations have turned this time. Nice down smash though. Just really trying to get any trade, but any trade hurts Mojo right now. Nice up smash. Calls out Icy, but Icy still survives. Up throw, up air. It's dangerous for Mojo. Uh, another up air by Mojo. Still no KO. And now I'm going to be joined by Slicer. Hey, what's up? So, Chen boy. Yeah, so far, Mojo finally got the up smash read, so... It's still... You can still bring it back, but I just want to take a series of reads. This is what I call a banana fight. We yeah. both have the bananas ready, but okay, not anymore. Yeah. I mean, they tend to be. They're also getting this trying the same options on each other. Like they're both going for fairs to approach, so they often end up trading. The problem is all the trades are hurting Mojo right now. I'm not sure why IC or Ise is uh, playing so nervous. I don't know. Yeah. I, I always see him just approaching like nothing, but this time he's having some trouble approaching Mojo. I think it was because earlier in the games, like Mojo's defensive style was just really punishing Icy. Yeah, I see Mojo just copying Icy's moves. Like for example, he just ran up and grabbed him. Yeah. I don't see him doing that much, uh, doing that often. Just out of range of that force smash. I think. The, I believe. I mean, although he wanted damage, I think a back throw might have been better just for positioning. Yeah. Order. It's pretty stale right now. Yeah. Mojo, so he's Ooh. trying to the same thing again, trying to go for the dash attack up smash, and right now he's just tossing out an up smash. Both players are actually, because the next smash attack KOs. He's gonna, this is pretty tense right now. I think Icy's looking for a, da a down tilt to up, uh, up smash. Oh, well, okay. Yeah. I think he does that. The problem is Mojo has Icy's banana. So yeah. If Mojo doesn't <laughs> toss his banana, Icy's just in a, such a disadvantaged position because. Can't do anything but hold shield, otherwise he risks just getting banana and then force smashed. He doesn't want to let it go either. Huh. Right. Mojo's just doing a good job with the control because Icy can't do anything right now. Yeah, he can't really okay, now he can. Yeah. Okay. I yeah, of course. Yep. Okay. Oh. Mojo fell for that. I think I disagree with that. Mojo should have just kept him in that situation because Yeah. Why did he throw it? I don't know. It was the, the adventure was on him. He just had to put out pay, be out more pay.